Grade 12, Vocabulary, Unit 8, Student's Book, page 116. Lesson Objectives. Today we are going to have two different objectives. The first one, Consolidate Vocabulary using Gap Filling Activities. The second objective will be using the new vocabulary in context effectively. Exercise one, let's have a look at the new vocab. Look after, to take care of somebody, to be in a charge of something or somebody. Aims, what do you want to do? What do you want to achieve? Control, to be able to handle, to operate, rule something. He's ruling a ship here. Navigate, to navigate, to follow us a path, to go in a particular uh, direction. Approach, to come uh, near someone and talk to him. State, means country or a government, state of Qatar. Yes, exercise one, replace the word simple with look after, aims, Find the way, talk to, control, state. Number one, everyone in our neighborhood goes to a public high school. Which one? Yes, excellent, state high school. Number two, what are your goals in life? What are your goals? It's very easy, goals, aims. Number three, can you handle a boat properly? Yes, handle. Awesome. Control. Number four. He's a friendly person who's easy to approach. Which one? Yes. Talk to. Number five. Students are encouraged to take care of. This is very easy. Take care of. Look after. Number six. Sailors used to navigate by the stars at night. Navigate means find the way. Exercise two, choose the correct word. The research team counted, measured water pollution. Shall I count water pollution one, two, three? No. So actually measured water pollution to know the amount of water pollution. Number two, traditional lessons, subjects are taught as well as scuba diving and Boat building, scuba diving, boat building. These are areas of study, so it will be subjects. The museum was built on a position or a site. Site, a place of a building where it was built, building site. But possession, this is a place in relation to other places. I mean, possession of a map on the map, we put the sofa in different positions. So actually, it will be on a, a site. We set up, opened an environmental group. So, I mean, to open and close or establish, prepare something for use, organizing different parts. Yes, actually, establish, organizing different parts. It will be set up an environmental group. Schools used to teach more realistic, practical skills like cookery and woodwork. So I need practical things and a real situation, not just ideas, but realistic, accepting things as they are in fact. Uh, so cooking and woodwork is a practical. So they are more practical skills. Asia's project is based, located on environmental issues. Uh, it's not a place to take located. So actually it will be <laughs> based on. That's fine. Let's look. Greenhouse, uh -huh. the, a glass or a plastic structure for growing and planting vegetables and plants. Enthusiastic, a feeling, very interested and keen. Look at the boys, they are very interested and keen to participate. Low income, uh -huh. look at the man, not earning much money from working. Exercise three, fill in with greenhouse, 
enthusiastic, low-income, expert culture control. The city has a maritime because it's next to the sea. Maritime culture. Educational are very impressed with the school. Educational, excellent, experts. Can you take of the boat for a while? Can you take control of the boat? Number four, families often can't afford private education. Yes, can't afford, they don't have enough money, so low income. My father, number five, my father grows vegetables in his. Where can I grow vegetables? Excellent, in his greenhouse. Number six, my students were about the trip down the river. Excellent, enthusiastic. Now go to your student's book, open page 116, exercise 4, match the verbs to the nouns to make phrases related to things you do at school. It's okay. Look at the book, take your time, stop the video and try to match. Now check your answers, enroll on a course, do your homework, have a break, get low marks, high marks, pay attention to the teacher, study math, music, history. Thank you. Course. This is a series of lessons you take. Degree. It's uh, uh, the certificate that you achieve after a course you study in a college or university, the kind of qualification. Passes. So the pass is the successful result in an examination. Lecture. Former class in a university. Tutor. He's the person who works with one student or two outside school or outside the university. Exercise five, underline the correct word. Peter is doing a six month IT course, curriculum, program, schedule at a technical college. So I'm speaking about IT, series of lessons. So it's gonna be course. He's studying for a certificate Degree, diploma, qualification in history, in a certain degree. So, degree in history. Mary got five grades, marks, passes, results in her GCSE exams. It's going to be passes. About 200 students attend professor. Professor, the man who works in the university, Nelson's two-hour class. Lecture, lesson, seminar on ancient sea trade. As I told you, professor, so it's going to be lecture. Number five, lender's parents hired a private. Aha, uh -huh, private, so he's not in the school. Headmaster, professor, teacher, tutor to help her with physics. So it's going to be tutor. Phrasal verbs run. Run and the best. Huh. Ran. Number one, into. He ran into, collided. Number two, out of. He runs out of, have no more. Across. He runs across, meet by chance. Away. He ran away, left quickly. Fill in the gaps with the correct particle from the spider gram we studied before. I ran a in while I was going to school. I ran across, met him by chance. Number two, a bus ran a police car. Thankfully, no one was injured, so ran, ran into, collided. Number three, they ran money and had to close their business. 
they had no money, so ran out of. Number four, when they saw the headmaster, they ran. They were afraid, so they ran away. Thank you. Finally, don't forget to do your homework on Teams today. Don't forget today. Thank you very much.